Yep, yeah, this is uh, Sunny Obsidian Creek here in Altoona, Pennsylvania. We're with Kevin today. Yep. Jim Owen, just assistant here in the Wiz. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I know, don't look well, here, it here. Don't stick it out too far, right? You don't want me licking it that hard, huh? No. Nope. I heard a week I later. Lick it that hard. Going to find some obsidian here. He's a comedian, too. I'll lick you harder later, babe. Oh. Oh, my. I don't take a serious 90% of the time. <laughs> <laughs> this would be one I'm going up on YouTube. Oh, I see they sold up the pine tree over here. Yeah, well, we used to, I used to cut that grass. That's the one big one I was telling you about was down. I guess they decided to... There's where all the roots came up, see? Yep. Now they sold it all up. Yep. This is about a week and a half later, and they're still cleaning up after Sandy's raft in here in PA. Right now, we're going down to find some obsidian here in the crit. Jump down over the wall here. Ah, oh, he's got the right idea to save up some lumber. Cut this grass. Huh. Oh, that's cool. Years ago. I don't know which way you yeah. want to go down. See the sign still laying there. Yeah, that's the one I was telling you about, washed downstream. I'm going down this way. <laughs> when we get down that way, you think? I usually just jump off, but I got my phone running now, so. There. <laughs> yeah, let's just get down along the water enough. Everybody's got waterproof boots here. Woohoo! Oh, -ho. there's a slippery rock right there, man. All right, we got down here. <laughs> this is part of a volcanic vent, cause way underground. You'll find a lot of obsidian down farther downstream. You might run into them once in a while. They do pass through like everybody else. <laughs> we got a hunter down here with us today. Wow. Find one. Here's one. Some green. This. Uh huh. Well, they do make air. They did have arrows made out of them at one time. What the hell? Hey, here's some of that stuff. Yeah, that's the one I broke off. <laughs> Alrighty. Said like an arrowhead. Yeah, this might have been part of one at one time. Yep. It was, Kevin. It's a part of one. I had one that was completely green and was one that was black at time. Yep, that's some nice obsidian. See, so there's one that's green and purple. Yep. Mixed. But you get the black, get the snowflake obsidian down here. A little bit of multi-variety of all colors here, for sure. This piece of cool. Yep. But, uh, yeah, further upstream, like I said, what I originally showed that volcanic dike at, up there, that's where some of the, uh, blue stuff come washing out at. Oh, this got washed downstream from Sandy. There's a nice big chunk of green, black, black and green. Hmm, interesting. Yep. Sure is. Yeah. So I said there's a lot of different ones down here now since that rain we had from that hurricane. A lot of high wind. Some kind of stuff washed down there. It's a pretty big chunk of air, see? Black and gray. Keep that one. Yeah. Yeah, they're always looking for a lot of green up towards Salem, you know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's some green white there. There's some tobacco there. Yep, tobacco cigs. Well, there's a piece of shaped glass. Ooh, there's a piece. Look at that. Look at this shaped glass. 
See how shiny that one is? Oh, that's weird. I might probably bust it off something washing downstream, yeah. Yeah, that's some blue. Yeah, glass. Nice to find some blue like that. Oh, yeah. Blue cobalt. But yep, that gives you a little brief tutorial. I don't have a shitload of memory on here, so I'm going to save this right now. They're here in Altoona, Pennsylvania. Obsidian hunting today. Oh yeah, nice piece of green to put on the last part of the video. Yeah.